and we are back with more glitches in the matrix. Today, let's look at a combination of both photos and stories of people who witnessed a glitch in the matrix. Stay tuned. Starting off this countdown, we have the ladies on the bus. Imagine hopping onto a bus only to realize that it's filled with identical looking women. The odds of that happening are very slim, but alas, it has happened. This individual was on a bus filled with women, all wearing similar outfits, a beige trench coat and dark jeans, and they all had the same blonde dyed hair. Not only that, but all women were roughly around the same age. I don't know if a Karen convention was in town or what. Still, that's truly bizarre for that to happen. Coming in at number nine, we have the appearing check. This story was submitted by Reddit user BR Anderson. A couple of years ago, he received a call saying that he had some old fines that he needed to pay. If he didn't pay these fines, he was told he was going to be arrested. The total was 267 and 63 cents. This was around Christmas time, so the guy was really strapped for money. However, the very next day, he got a check in the mail for $267.63, the exact amount he needed to pay the fines. Apparently, he had overpaid for child support throughout the years, and this was the amount given back to him. That is wild. Like, the amount is same down to the cents. It's insane. In our eighth spot today, we have the doppelganger. It's believed that every person has roughly six doppelgangers out there in the world. Have you ever met one of your doppelgangers? Let me know in the comments below. Well, this woman did. She was at a Coldplay concert in Gothenburg, Sweden, when she found her twin. She had the same blonde hair, and eerily enough, they were wearing the exact same outfit, round shades with a gold trim and a beige trench style raincoat. So not only did they look alike, but they dressed alike as well. In our seventh spot today, we have the time jump. This next individual has experienced a time jump on multiple occasions. He'd leave work and somehow get home in five minutes when the drive was 15 to 20 minutes. But he's not the only one that says that this has happened. Other people have shared similar stories on the exact same road. It even happened to his friend that rode in the same car with him. He noticed this jump as well. It's super strange. This road somehow like teleports them or something. I have no clue. They have definitely found a glitch though. Coming in at number six, we have the blue haired ladies. Now blue hair is pretty cool, but it's not common. Like not every day do you go out and see someone rocking bright, bold blue hair. So what are the odds that two women with blue hair and similar outfits appear in the same place together and they're strangers? So this woman was visiting the US for the first time when she met someone that was dressed identical to her while she was at the Met. They both have blue short hair and are wearing gray coats and yellow scarves. I'm gonna say this a lot in today's video, but seriously, what are the odds of this happening? Like the outfit, the hair, everything. Come on, what are the odds? We are now at our fifth and halfway mark with the teleporting man. This next man and his brother were walking through the West Town Mall in Knoxville, Tennessee, when they saw this interesting man. He was 6'5", was carrying a staff, and wore a floor-length black duster jacket. The man was just a bit ahead of them when he turned towards the exit and left the mall. That's when they lost sight of him. Not more than 30 seconds later, out pops this guy right in front of them. He was now at the opposite end of the mall. Now, according to the narrator, this mall is huge. It would take at least five minutes to walk the length of it. But somehow, this guy exited the mall and ended up in a different area in 30 seconds. So what, he went outside and sprinted around the mall to the other entrance? It doesn't really make sense. This man glitched and somehow teleported. Or there's two of him, I don't know. Coming in at number four, we have the opposite twins. This photo I'm about to show you is of two strangers who got on the same train, but just at different stations. And they just so happen to be wearing opposite colors. Take a look. They got the same sweaters on. The guy on the left has an orange sweater with green hair, and the guy on the right has a green sweater with orange hair. Plus, it's literally the same sweater, just opposite colors. I just love how they match each other's hair. Like, it was meant to be. They better have talked and became best friends after that, because that is truly bizarre. And it was meant to be, I feel like. Moving on to number three, we have the radar detector. 
So this man was driving down a highway in Ohio when his radar detector went off. So he slammed on his brakes and slowed right down. And right over the hill that he was driving on, there indeed was a squad car running radar. And he almost got caught. So he was super relieved. However, when he looked over to the detector, which is normally on his windshield, he noticed it wasn't even there. In fact, it was unplugged and sitting in his glove compartment, but it literally went off seconds before. That's how we knew that the radar was there. In any sense, this glitch helped him avoid getting a ticket. So there you go. Coming in at number two, we have the changing hotel. So this next family was driving to Florida to go to Disney World with their kids. They decided to make the drive instead of flying to save some money. But since the drive would take about a day and a half, they made a pit stop at a hotel for the night. However, the next morning when they woke up, they found themselves in their hotel in Disney, which makes absolutely no sense. Maybe that's the magic of Disney. I don't know. Like they checked into the best Western and the next thing they're at Disney. I mean, that glitch certainly worked out in their favor. They didn't have to continue driving the next day, but like they just somehow teleported to Disney in their sleep. It makes no sense. I am confused. And in our number one spot today, we have the frozen time. This next individual experienced a weird glitch in which time froze. So she was in her room when she decided to go down to the kitchen and make herself a sandwich. She clocked the time and it was 6.48 PM. She went to the kitchen, made a sandwich, got some chips, my favorite, and even poured herself a drink. This took her at least 10 minutes. When she got back into her room, she checked the clock and it was frozen at 6.48 PM. She even checked her phone. Sure enough, it was still at 6.48 PM. Then all of a sudden it changed to 6.49. So somehow time froze or she managed to get all that food made in less than a minute. Again, I am confused, this makes no sense. Maybe we are living in a matrix or a simulation. I don't know, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Have you guys ever experienced a glitch in the matrix? If you have, maybe I'll uh, shout out your story in the next video, just let me know. Or you can DM it to me on Instagram, up to you. All right guys, that's all for today's video. Let's move on to our comment shout out portion. I'll be shouting out comments from the video, top 10 time capsules from history that haven't been opened yet, part two. Check out the video if you haven't. It's a good one. Patricia Lynn commented, I really enjoy these interesting videos. This is a lot better than watching the History Channel and these special to watch for sure. Uh, I am flattered. The History Channel? Bro, thank you so much that I'm more interesting than those guys. Okay, that's like a professional production. I just filmed this in my house. So, wow, huge compliment. Thank you. V Flores commented, going through a rough time in life right now, but your videos always pump up the vibes. Love all the interesting facts about the videos. Thanks for your videos. Oh, stay strong. It's a hard time. Everyone is going is going through a hard time right now. I even am. Um, so just stay strong. I'm here sending you love and support. You guys got this. I promise everything will work out in the end. So just stay strong guys. And Serana commented, can I have a shout out please? Yes, you can. Here is your comment shout out. There you go. All right guys, that's all the comments I'm shouting out for today's video. Make sure to comment something down below for a chance to be featured in my next comment shout out. Even your stories, let me know. And with that being said, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to Most Amazing Top 10 for more amazing videos. I've been your host, Lindsay Ivan, and I'll see you when I see you. Bye.